hello guys i'm gonna be very quick with this because a lot of you have been asking of this tutorial so let's get into it today we are going to look at how to create um, a still image animation inside of photoshop so you can see this um, image i have of this guy over this background we are actually going to animate him to move his hands so what's amazing about this is that it's a still image but at the end of the day we are going to end up animating it in photoshop i've um, gotten a lot of requests asking me to do this tutorial so that is why i decided to do it today okay so let's get into it i have isolated him from this background if you don't know how to do that make sure you watch my um, tutorial on how to make someone disappear from a background in photoshop i'll put a link in the description box below for you to watch that then also um i've also um removed him from this background if you don't know how to do that fall back to my tutorial on how to remove an image from a background i also put a link in the description box on how you can do that but today we are going to look at how to animate him so let's just select this image and make a copy of it we want to turn it to a smart object so we just right click on it convert to a smart object then let's go over to edit and add a puppet warp um if you watch my tutorial on how to create multiple hands you will understand um the reason why i'm adding a puppet warp because i want to manipulate the hands so i'm clicking on this to add all these pins on this image so the pins is actually going to help me to reshape his hands so i'll start from clicking on this one raising it up up to this point then i'm going to do the same thing for this you can see now he has um, two different hands all right i'm going to say okay to this then um over here i'm going to have a background with a smart filter puppet warp so let's just drag that to this layer icon to make a copy of it double click on the puppet warp icon here you are going to see these pins again so in case you don't want to um you want to change the position of this pin i can just right click and delete it okay then i can add it back then change the position all right so somewhere here it's okay so that it doesn't look unrealistic okay let's say check for that and make another copy of this double click on this again this time around i want to add one more pin somewhere here because i want to straighten this as this is moving i want to move this a little bit okay so i want to straighten this and move this as well all right somewhere there is okay no we say okay to that then we make another copy of this double click on it and just straighten the hands somewhere here so we can continue to go on and on to create more multiple of this but i think with five layers i'm going to delete this pin because it's a kind of bending then i'll add it again so i'm going to add one more pin here in order to bend this a little bit okay somewhere there should be okay let's press ctrl one you can see he's having five hands now but the key thing is for us to actually animate this for him to move those hands that is why we are um, creating this tutorial today so i'm gonna um, quickly right click on this and rasterize it back from the smart object so rasterize 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 layer so you can see these are individual layers now can you see that so for us to animate this make sure you come over to your window and turn on timeline so you can see the timeline here i'm going to double click on the background to unlock it all right we have create um frame video then we have um create video on the timeline so we're actually going to use create frame animation so let's um shift select the entire thing then we are going to click over here on the layers flyout menu we load this inside so select this shift select this one
okay so let's click on create in order to activate that then we now um say make frame from layers so that will allow us to have this individual image but the problem is the background is not cutting across this images so what we can do is to delete this background we come over here and select it then we come back to the layers um, to the timeline flyer menu then we tell it to match layer across frames so it's going to match it across the frames you can see that now so finally to get this I'm going to select all this layer click on this small arrow here and set the timing to 0.2 seconds so when I play this can see it's moving the hand so i might actually set this to forever so that i keep on playing you can see pretty much easy to animate um, a still image inside of photoshop there are so many ways you can do this and get a result now if you want to export this out you can come over to file then we have a spot where you can render video so when you click on that it's gonna take some few time so you can actually export this as an mp4 you can also take it out and save it out as a gif okay so thank you for watching i'm gonna stop here for today don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you have any question kindly leave it in the description box below we we'll surely attend to you see you next time bye